Hey, what's up everyone? Glock9 here and welcome back to 10 Minutes to Die. It is the morning of day 15. I've got some skill points to spend here this morning. Four of them. Let's go better barter twice. Since we rely so heavily on the trader. And let's go minor 69er level 1. And let's just go strength again. Okay, let's stop home and heal up. And then we'll go see Jen. I know I got some honey, and I should have one more sewing kit left after I made that double pocket mod. There's the honey. Leaves us with two jars left. And there's the sewing kit. That'll cure up the laceration. Let me repair these knuckle wraps, because I'm going to go sell those. And uh, just dump some stuff off here that we're not going to need. What's up, Jen? What is this bullshit? Pose the grade slower, I guess I'll take that. Alright, let me sell you this stuff here. And what do you have? Molotovs. And pipe bombs, those have been working out for us. Alright. Buy as many pipe bombs as I can. Now I want to take a look at the special job to see where the next trader is. Uh, north of here, kilometer away, which is not too bad, but I'm not cruising up there on my bicycle. I'll wait till I get a mini bike to do that. Now, I could go back uh, to the previous tier and do tier one jobs, but screw it. I'm doing a tier two. Fetch and clear. Let's see how this works out. Alrighty. Let's fire this job up. It looks like the supplies are in the house, and we're starting in the detached garage. This could be a good place to fight a quick horde. Right up here, let's put a hatch down in the doorway. Let's actually make two hatches. Put one down right here, and then we'll knock the door out. Put another one right there. At this point in the game, we just need to survive, that's all. Need to survive through the horde and through the night, and then we can uh, proceed with doing whatever it is we were doing. I don't plan on defeating the entire horde from here on out. As a matter of fact, if shit gets crazy, I'm not opposed to running away. I just want to live. We can get a little bit of iron from these barbed wire fences here. We can use that to upgrade the hatches upstairs. One lock pick. Let's grab this cobblestone. Let's also get some wood from these spikes and we'll make our own spikes. Just a few to put by the stairs. Thin the herd just a bit. I don't really use spikes anymore. I haven't in a while. I feel like they don't do that much damage, and you don't get any experience from zombies that get killed on spikes, so I just tend not to use them. Alright, I'm not jumping down there, obviously, because the horde's going to start soon. We can get a little more iron from here, and from this dolly. What are they doing? Beating on the stairs? Fucking zombies. Anything to not run into the spikes, right? I should have known better. All those things do is fuck up the zombie pathing. Unless you, like, make a pit full of spikes that the zombies can fall into. Or if you, like, surround your support columns with spikes. That's, like, the only way to use them. Otherwise, they just screw shit up. Oh, that went right past them. Yeah, and over the steps. Let's try that again. Son of a bitch. Ow. Third time's a charm. That got him. They're just running around down there. Let's grab this loot bag. Nice. All right, then. I guess I'll just shoot some arrows at him. They knocked the steps out down here, but... Can't they make that jump up? Ow! Fucking skinny Pete under the steps. Look, now they're getting up. Oh, 
Well, I guess all I had to do was knock the steps out. Could have used melee all night. Come on, shitheads. Let's finish this. Okay, now we can get started. And I know I just said I didn't plan on defeating the entire horde from here on out, but it just depends on the circumstance. If it's just a few walkers left, of course I'm going to defeat them. I don't need them bothering me while I'm trying to loot this place. But if it's a giant group still, and we're in a position where we can leave the area, then I'm just going to leave. Oh, shit. What the hell? I was sitting here mining this iron the whole time. Nothing, and then all of a sudden, everyone wakes up. What the hell? Watch out, buddy. There's a glitch in the matrix right there. Don't want to fall into the void. I guess he don't care. Nope. Don't want that shitty bandage. I should probably skip on looting trash, but I can't help myself. Ooh. I forgot I picked up 9mm ammo. Should get that pistol loaded. I think zombies uh, bust out of here. Yep. Just one. Not a big deal. Okay. Take both of those things. Hold on to that splint. You never know. Some trash in here. Scrap the cans for the iron. That's locked. Drink that now. There are the supplies. Let's grab this cobblestone first. Okay, now we just gotta kill the rest of the zombies. Oh, here we go. Hour 13, you think we can finish this place before the next horde shows up? I don't think so. Oh, hey, Kenny. Oh, hey, Kenny. Nice. Looks like we got one more right here. Please tell me you're the last one, lady. Because I need to get ready for this horde. You are beautiful. Okay, loot's in there. We'll grab that later. Right now, we need to knock some steps out. And it is starting. I think the zombies have to break into the house, so we should have a second, but I probably should pull these frames up anyway. While I upgrade these bars to cobblestone. And I should probably put another set in right here. And then I'm going to put these frames back in place, and we can always pull them up if uh, it's getting too crazy or whatever. Or shoot them out, or do whatever we need to do. Because without those frames there, the zombies can't get up. I mean, if they're going to take forever, we might as well loot. 25 pieces of gunpowder? Yeah, I'm going to take that. It doesn't sell for much, but I'm not looking to sell that. I'm looking to use that to craft ammo once we get a workbench down. Here we go. Electronics crate? It sounds like they're getting up. Yeah, yeah, we better deal with this. Ow. Bullshit, man. Like, 80% of the time I get hit, it's some bullshit. Did that fall down? Damn it. Wasting pipe bombs. Oh, that's nice. I don't know where the rest of the horde is. I certainly don't mind them taking their time, though. See you later, bitch. Ah, here comes a decent-sized group. Now's probably a good time to use a pipe bomb. Let's do that. Oh, that's good. Sweet. I'll sell that. I'll read that, sell that, and I'll hold on to that headlight. It's morning now, so not worried about the zombies. Sell, read. Murky water, let's pop in here. 
Grab the main stash and get back to Jen's. Give me a wrench or a hammer, please. A pickaxe. Not gonna complain about that. Bring that down. Okay, what do we got here? 10% more damage with clubs. That's beautiful. What you got for me, Jen? Good job. I sledgehammer? How about a club? I'll take the sledgehammer, though. But I'm just gonna sell it back to her. She's got a crucible schematic, and we can afford it, but... I'm not buying it, because it's not gonna help us out any. Alright. Let's, uh, do another job then. Right. I'm gonna do another tier two, Stay but if the reward isn't great, I'm probably gonna go back to tier yeah, one. At least we were getting so. ammo for yeah. tier one jobs. Sunload some of this shit here. Oh. Uh, I need my ammo back. Let's not do something that stupid. And I'm just gonna use this first aid kit. This place again? Nope. Not doing it. This is a waste of time, but I don't care. Grumpy's Pub. This is more like it. Coming up on hour 16. Holy shit. Alright, that's okay though. I'm familiar with this POI and... Um, holding down a horde here shouldn't be too bad. Oh, shit, I have nothing to upgrade anything with because I scrapped my stone axe when I got the pickaxe. That was a smart move. I need plant fiber so we can craft another one. Look at all these feathers. I gotta go for them. Okay, that should definitely be enough plant fiber. What? Oh, stone. Duh. Stone. Stone. Give me some fucking stone. Now oh, the pickaxe would be better for this. There we go. Bam. All right. Uh, nothing like wasting time uh, when the days are 10 minutes long. Okay. Upgrade this. Shit. <laughs> A lot of good that did. Well, I needed that anyway. So I'm going to have to upgrade these double poles. Uh, let's just do pole. There we go. Alright, there are gonna be zombies on the rooftop. So we should probably take them out now. Yep. Just a couple of them. Not a big deal. We are starting. Here are the supplies. Job is done. All we gotta do now is deal with this horde, grab the main loot, and we can get out of here. Let's knock this out here. I'm gonna need a frame to get back up, though. Okay. Zombies are taking their time. They're probably breaking through the front door. Now we can get up. If or when we need to. Oh, shit! Oh, well, they're coming in this way anyway. Let's feed it right through the hatch. Oh, that's beautiful. Yes. And here comes wave number two. This is great. We just always need to have pipe bombs on us. Son of a bitch. Go around, you fucks. We're getting sandwiched in here. That'll take care of these bitches. Oh, nice. Give me this loot. Wrench. That's good. Oh, shit. Not good. They're fucking crawling in through the window. My god. We are bleeding out. At least it's morning. Fuck you, lady. Now let's do that, and we can get back up to this ladder if we need to, which we should probably do that right now. This guy's gotta go. 
Okay. Now, I don't mind jumping down. We had a dog during the horde. There should be a dog back here also, though, so we just need to be careful. I mean, the stash is right in here. I just want to grab this and get the fuck out of here. Nice. 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 Okay, hold on. What the fuck? Ah, it's still there. 20% greater chance of knocking down your target. I'm gonna sell the other book since we read it already. And, uh, let's just bail. No sense in sticking around here. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Wow, I didn't what the hell? Iron sledgehammer and boots again? I don't need this shit. I need ammo. Uh, I guess we're going back to tier one. Was easier, and we got ammo as a reward. Uh, this is the same stuff she had. Nothing we can use right now. Thanks for the business. All right. We're open from dawn to dusk. Tier one. You know, we don't have clocks. Um, let's do this. I just the thanks, son. I'll be back, baby. We're gonna fight the next horde here at home, and then we'll go do this job. I want to see if I can repair that block. Where is it? Around here? In the closet? Yep. It's this one right here. Now well, we might as well upgrade it to cobblestone. That's good. Uh, give me that ladder. Here we go. Bop. Oh, there goes your arm, lady. Now you can only service one customer at a time. Let's get a pipe bomb in action. Oh, shit. Oh, that was a nice throw, though. Beautiful. Fuck out of here, Kenny. Oh, Kenny's dead. You know, this setup, with a little bit of work, I think... Could do good. It's it's just not right the way it is now, though. Come on. Fuck. Oh, that's not good. Jeez. Any more getting up? Yep. Oh, they're all jumping up there. It's like monkey see, monkey do over here. Oh, shit. I need to fix this doorway, too. Uh, I don't know, man. It's getting crazy. It's getting way too crazy. I feel like... I, I thought the way to do this was to crank out as many jobs as quick as possible so we can continuously earn money and be able to buy ammo, and I thought that was how we were going to keep up with the ammo situation. But... I don't know. Maybe I played this wrong. Maybe we should have been building an efficient base from day one. We should have started working on something. Something that we can use... A lot of melee with to conserve ammo. But it's too late now. I feel like it's too late to try to start building a base at this point. It's like we got to go with these makeshift bases. And at the same time, too, this is kind of more fun. It's running around and trying to put together a base quickly at some POI we just showed up at. You know, I kind of like that. But how long is that sustainable for, you know? Not that long, I don't think. I gotta put some bars in right here. This will at least prevent the zombies from jumping sideways onto the rooftop. And uh, we should still be able to use melee. Yeah, that won't be a problem. And then, to prevent them from jumping on the hatch, we just need to keep the top one open. Whoops. Here we are, little diner. All we gotta do is clear the area. How hard could that be? How about a Mega Crush? Nope. Could probably just drink one of those and run around all night. 
It probably lasts as long as the horde will last. Hey, there's a Mega Crush. That's good. Save that for an emergency. Zombies and a bird. Oh, here's the bird. Where are the zombies? Would they jump off the roof? That's exactly what they did. Good on that bandage. I will take this bird's feathers, though. Exploding arrows and bolts. Oh, man, those would be awesome to have. I need to craft those in a workbench, though, so... We're still on the quest for a workbench. Nothing there. Some trash right here. All right, we need to finish off the remaining zombies and then prepare for the horde, which we're going to fight right here in this room. Well, come on in. Um, oh, shit. Had a little brain fart right there. I was like, do I need that axe? No, I do not need that axe. And the engine I could use for the mini bike, but I'll probably just sell it because I could use the money right now. We can always find another engine when it's time to craft the mini bike. Whoops. Can't stand on that hatch, otherwise, we hit the top pole. All right. Let's knock some of this ladder out. Now, you'd think I would have learned from Lucky Looter to knock the bottom portion of the ladder out, not the top, because it doesn't matter if we knock two pieces of the top of the ladder out, because the bottom zombies will just push the top zombies up. Man, we are being overrun already. Horde hasn't even started. We got a little wandering horde, I guess. Let's take him out with one of these. Fuck yous. Ow, that hurt a little bit. Nice. Come on. Fucking three mo's. Where's Larry and Curly? You son of a bitch. Man, this is a bad spot. Uh, just get it in there. Oh, shit. Damn it! Oh, this is not working out. Not at all. Take the ladder out. Come on. Give me that ladder. Uh, we lost the hatch when I took the old ladder out, because that's what was supporting the hatch. Oh, uh, look, I can just hit him from here. That's sweet. Probably should get a pipe bomb down there. That worked. Fuck off, lady. Oh, shit. Yeah, they're getting up. When there's enough of them down there, I guess it doesn't matter. How many pieces of ladder I knock out? Mm, God. Come on. No. Uh, pipe bomb. That should help. Mm. Not good. Not good. Oh, fuck. We gotta go. That sucked. There was a loot bag that fell in there, though. I hate to leave that behind. I gotta heal up, though. There's a zombie chasing me. All right. Should have enough time. Here he comes. Let's circle back to the restaurant. It's morning now. At least they won't be running. Damn it. Man, we got our ass kicked last night. Worst horde so far. I mean, we had to run away. Or we were going to die. Just want to grab this loot bag. I'll get back to Jen's.
Ah, screw it. Ammo, please. Oh, this is horse shit. Another little diner that we have to clear out and then fight a horde at. This should go fine. A pipe shotgun. I don't have any shotgun shells on me, unfortunately, but I got plenty of them back at home. As much shit as I talk about that weapon, I will use it. Get the fuck out of here, potato. Well, this is gonna be the area where we fight the horde, I guess. We'll block off the ladder with some bars. And we could put down a frame and then put another set of bars to double up. And we just shoot through the bars. And if we drop a pipe bomb on top of the bars, that should blow the zombies off of the ladder. So that's how we're going to do it. Oh, God, this is not good. It's not happening fast enough. Shit. Not even loaded up. Can you believe that? Get out of here. Give me a second. Let me finish. Oh, God. They're going to break through that set of bars before I can even put this second set in. Okay. Come on. Oh, my God. There's too many. Too many. There they go. First set of bars gone already. Oh, shit. Really? That was such a fail. Oh, my God. Oh, that was cool. We completely failed, though. Completely failed. It's either run or die. Pick one. Oh, that's embarrassing. I mean... I could... Try and get back up on the rooftop. Or just cruise around the diner until morning. Okay. I'm going for it. Get up. Get up. Come on, bitches. Fuck you. Oh, that's not going to work at all. And now the horde's chasing me. We'll lead him back to Jen's. Maybe she can help us out. Oh, tell me there's a way out through the back here. No. We can just knock this fence out. Hurry, there's a dog. Oh, shit. Fuck. God. Well, last night was uh, something else. Let's just pretend last night never even happened. What the son of a bitch? Oh, well, this is perfect, actually. Perfect place to just end it right now because I'm done. My palms are sweating. This series is just absolutely fucking mental. Like I was saying earlier, I think maybe I went about it the wrong way. Probably should have immediately tried to start building some sort of melee-only base to try and conserve ammo. That might have been the better idea for longevity. But then again, you know, how are you going to progress if all you do is work on a base? You need to stop and loot. You need to get resources. You can't just start building a base. We can do build it out of wood only. You got to get cobblestone. I mean, granted, you can get clay and stone and make cobblestone, but still, it's fucking crazy. I suggest you try it. It is fun. I'll admit that. And I hope you guys are having fun watching it. Thank you so much for watching it and all of the support. You guys are the best. You can follow me on Instagram or Twitter if you want. It's at Glock9Gamer. I follow all gamers back. Stick around for more 10 minutes to die, and I will catch you guys in the next episode. <laughs>